Welcome back to News 2 Midday. Very exciting. We have Megan from the South Carolina Aquarium. Megan, we have some very special guests today. Tell us about them. Yeah, so we have some uh, sea stars here. Okay. And I've brought sea stars before, but these guys are really unique and special looking um, because they are in the process of regenerating limbs. Okay. So this is what sea stars are famous for. And I'm going to lift this one up so you can kind of see here. Um, this one, these are the normal limbs, their arms, and right. what, what they should they and eventually will. Tiny ones down there. Yeah, and these little ones are being regenerated. It's likely this sea star lost their legs to a predator. Okay. Um, it's pretty common. They can lose a leg to a predator or disease. They can even detach a leg, like, you know, you think of like a lizard losing its tail huh. if it feels threatened, um, and they, they grow back. Wow. So how long does it take for the legs to grow back? It depends on the species, and it depends on, you know, how much of the leg was lost uh -huh. and, you know, the health of the sea star overall. So anywhere between a month and a year. Wow, okay, that's a pretty big gap there. It is, yeah, so that's a pretty general one. So it's kind of cool at the aquarium, you can kind of watch that process happen. Mm -hmm. This sea star is also regrowing some limbs, and you can see that they're, he's much further along. Mm -hmm. um, these are, the, again, the, those arms that are about the size that they'll grow to be, and these two are, you know, making their way back to that normal size. So how long would you say this one that you're holding has been working to regrow these two? These ones are relatively new to the aquarium, so I'm okay. not exactly sure how long. Okay. Um, you know, we get new ones from, um, you know, we get new ones that takes a little bit of different times to, to come back, depending on where they've come from. Wow, so how long have you had these ones then? Um, we just had these ones for a few weeks. They're okay. relatively new. So our, our touch tank, because they're in our touch tank. Okay. Um, these guys are, we're, we're kind of, have new animals there for guests to come and pet, and, um, you know, we have, we have the sea stars themselves, and we also also have urchins, um, hermit crabs, we even have sharks, all sorts of cool animals wow. that you can touch in the, tu in the touch tank. Fantastic. So how long do starfish, you know, how long do they live for? They can live about 10 to 15 years. Okay. Yeah, and they're really, they're commonly found right here in South Carolina, right on our beaches. And is the preferred name sea star or is it starfish? Yes, yeah, so the common name, you know, you hear us, you hear the term sea starfish, uh -huh. but they're not really a fish at all. They're not, okay. uh, they're, you know, they're, a, they're something called an echinoderm. So the proper name for them is a sea star. Sea star. I like that better. So if people want to come to the touch tank, they can, you said they can have touch, touch sharks, they can touch sea stars. How can they get in? Just buy a regular general admission oh, ticket? Oh yeah, definitely. General okay. admission will bring you in and we have all sorts of cool animals that you can come see. Set our touch tank on the second floor um, is filled with cool animals. You can kind of see this one He's walking. Moving. Yeah, you can kind of see him walking up the side. Maybe he hears us. These <laughs> limbs are the arms and what's underneath that you can probably see through the glass bowl are their little tube feet. And so a lot of people, they come to the touch tank, they don't realize that these are even living creatures right. until you see them walking around and moving like that, which is pretty cool. How interesting. Well, thank you so much for bringing these in today. That is super cool. I learned a lot about sea stars, there not starfish. Um, and I'm excited to see them and see them keep regrowing their limbs and see how long that takes because that's obviously very cool. Yes, yeah, thank well, Megan, you. Well, Megan, thank you so much for joining us today. I really appreciate you. We'll have more news and weather coming up on News 2 Midday right after the break. Stick with us. We'll be back in just a few.